Hello fight fans and welcome to MMA Insider. In today's video, we've got a packed lineup of headlines. First off, Noche UFC bonus report. Next, pros react after Valentina Shevchenko versus Alexa Grasso 2 ends in a split draw. In addition, Valentina Shevchenko reacts following split draw in Alexa Grasso rematch. Following the conclusion of tonight's event, UFC officials announced at the post-fight press conference that five fighters would be taking home performance bonuses. Performance of the night, Daniel Zellhuber pocketed an extra $50,000 for his second round submission victory over Christos Giagos on tonight's UFC main card. Performance of the night, Raul Rosas Jr. earned an extra $50,000 for his first round knockout victory over Terrence Mitchell. Performance of the night, Lupi Godinez pocketed an extra $50,000 for her second round submission victory over Elise Reed. Performance of the night, Roman Kopolov earned an extra $50,000 for his second round TKO victory over Josh Fremt. Performance of the night, Charlie Campbell pocketed an extra $50,000 for his first round TKO victory over Alex Reyes. Tonight's UFC event was headlined by a women's flyweight title fight rematch between Alexa Grasso and Valentina Shevchenko. The main event proved to be a thrilling back and forth contest. Valentina Shevchenko had a strong start to the fight, getting the better of Alexa Grasso throughout the opening five minutes. However, in round two, Grasso was able to drop Shevchenko with a beautiful counterpunch and went on to easily win the second frame. Rounds three, four, and five were all close, but fans and analysts were seemingly divided on who they thought won after 25 minutes of action. In the end, the judges were torn as well, as the bout was ruled a split draw. After the fight, numerous MMA figures voiced their thoughts on Twitter regarding the fight. Here are their comments. Shevchenko won the fifth, dominated most of the round, messed up and got mounted but escaped pretty quick. I'd still say Shevchenko won round five. YouTube video incoming. An absolute corker of a fight, all-timer in women's MMA in my opinion, and it ends in a draw. Well done, Alexa Grasso and Valentina Shevchenko. Incredible. With a judge gave round five a 10-8, that's just taking the piss now. That's not a draw. There's no 10-8 round anywhere in that fight. 48-47 for Valentina is the correct scorecard, but could totally understand 48-47 Grasso too. Round five was more of a 9-9 instead of a 10-8 because of the early part of the round. Grasso won in my opinion. She had the knockdown and the ending was significant. They swore it was 2-2 in the fifth. I'm cool with watching them fight again, so that's the plan. Not mad at the decision, but I need to see that scorecard. Third fight in UFC Kyrgyzstan. Split draw during a championship fight gotta be the only time a fighter is okay with that decision. Shortly following the conclusion of tonight's event, Valentina Shevchenko spoke with Aaron Bronstetter, where she addressed the disappointing result. Valentina believes she was robbed, thinking the judges were biased in favor of Grasso due to Mexican Independence Day. Here's what she had to say. Um, I felt it's a little bit unfair. Uh, I felt it was three rounds my side, um, like two rounds your side. I felt that 10-8, it's kind of like mm, completely not right. And a draw in this fight, and like, yeah, definitely in a draw, uh, champion is still like holding the belt. But I feel um, maybe the pressure because of Mexican Independence Day, it was like affecting the judge's decision. But um, I'm happy that I did everything to uh, perform the best what I can, to give uh, to all fans the best fight what I uh, could give, and this is what I'm proud of. Thank you so much for tuning into today's video. Your dedication and support fuel our passion to bring you the latest and greatest in the MMA world. If you enjoyed today's news, please give us a thumbs up and share with fellow MMA fans. Remember to subscribe to stay in the loop with daily MMA updates. We've got a lot of exciting news, interviews, and analysis coming your way every single day. Your engagement helps us grow and serve the MMA community even better. Once again, thank you for being an integral part of our daily MMA journey.